Hi, I'm Nick Federoff, and today I'm gonna to show you how to properly eat a pomegranate. This program is brought to you in part by Organic Choice from miracle Grow. Vitamins, hormones, super thrive. The red ruby jewels that a pomegranate has to offer. Oh, they're so delicious. Pomegranate has a very rich history. It kind of goes back to the beginning of time where they were actually cultivated in Persia and then throughout Eurasia, they just spread. They didn't come to the United States, i.e. California, and until around 1792 or so, and then California and Arizona is the place where they grow like crazy. Interesting as well is that the Northern Hemisphere actually grows these usually between September through February, then the Southern Hemisphere, they grow them through March through the balance of the year. So it's kind of a neat thing when you think about it that we can have pomegranates all year round coming from different parts of the world. Well, how do you get the tasty little fruits out of these things? That's the whole key. Now, I know you're wondering why does he have his Sunday best on and not some old raggedy t-shirt because I'm gonna show you a trick to where you're not gonna make a big old mess and you're not gonna have to worry about it too much but I would put a, a shirt on, a, a, a bad shirt, uh, so you can get dirty because it is a potential problem for you. All right, the first thing that we're gonna do is that we're going to trim the pomegranate. And we need a sharp knife for this, so be careful. And we're gonna cut the top off. Ooh, look at that, is that good or what? I just wanna lick all that up. Then you wanna take and you wanna trim the end off as well. And, ooh, look at that, you just wanna, yeah, I already, already did that, right? Okay, now what we wanna do is that we wanna cut, but not all the way through it. We want to just score it, that's all we wanna do. And don't go too far, this center part you wanna go in just a little bit, and then you come out the edge like this, and you put it in half, you, you score it in half. Now, I want you to score it the other way. So when we're done with this, we're gonna have this all corded up. Now you see, I kinda had one blow up on me. So wearing old clothes or an apron probably isn't a bad thing after all. Okay, now what do we do with it? If I was to open this up, we could do it very carefully, but you see how the juice is getting everywhere and the last thing it said, it wanted to do is get it on your clothes. You get kinda mad, you know, whoever's washing your clothes. We're gonna put it in a bucket of water, look at that. We're gonna put it in some water, and then we're going to open it inside of the water. And look how, look how easy it opened. Yes, look at those ruby jewels. I can't help myself, I'm gonna pull one out right now, okay? This stuff is so good. It's gonna stain everything, so be careful. We're actually gonna open this up again. Now see how I'm doing this? I'm holding the sides, I'm putting it in the water, and then I'm pulling it apart, and Look at that, look how it comes. Now, if I was to, we're gonna actually peel the whole thing right inside of this water, the whole thing. So we're gonna bust this all apart and watch how this goes. And ironically, you're gonna have less of these pomegranate seeds. Fewer of them are actually gonna blow up on you because they're in the water. And you can go really fast if you want to. Your water's gonna get discolored because you are gonna smash some of them. Now, pomegranate trees are either that or they are shrubs. And believe me, these are not inexpensive. You ever buy a, like a quart of this stuff? Oh man, it runs into the money. Has antioxidants in it, which means that it helps you with bad things. And, oh, see, and this is all left behind. This right here is what the seeds were sitting in, and this is not tasty whatsoever. It doesn't taste good. And if you get one that gets lodged in there, it's not the end of the world. But I want to show you something. You see how the, you see how this is actually, this pith stuff is floating? Yeah, it's gonna stay on the top. In fact, there's, there's an actual membrane on here that's gonna fly off too in the water. And when it gets in the water, it's gonna float as well. And that's okay, let it do that. Now, we have a lot of things we can do with these seeds, and I'll tell you what, I'm gonna finish cleaning up this pomegranate, and then I'm gonna show you how to eat this a very special way. 
we have completed taking all of these beautiful red ruby seeds out of the pomegranate. And as you can tell, we have very little to no, none of the white stuff that's in there. By the way, it's not very tasty. So we have to decide what we're going to do with these. You can actually eat them straight. Oh, they're so good. Now, some people don't like the little core that's inside the seed, and they'll just eat around it and then spit it out. I think that's kind of gross. I like it. It's good roughage. But the seeds themselves, now you could take them and you could put them in salads, in different recipes. They're, they're, they're used in soups. Or if they were in the half size like we saw, you could actually take them and put them on a juicer. And then once you've juiced it, you strain all the goopy stuff out. You've got the juice that stuff. Oh, so good. And again, high in antioxidants. Now, this is something that I learned when I was a kid, and I've been eating them this way the whole time. And what we're going to do is we're going to take our pomegranates, and we're going to put them in a cup or a dish just like this. Then what we're going to do is we're going to take a little bit of sugar. Okay, I like sugar. That's it. We're going to put a little bit of sugar in there. Let's see what we're doing. Okay, we'll put it in a cup or a bowl. We have our pomegranates. Now I use this cup because, you know, pomegranates are pretty, the cup's pretty. Now we're going to take some milk and put some milk inside of it. Oh, yes, this is to die for, I tell you. Don't go, ew, it's nothing like that at all. Don't go, ew, unless you've tried it before. This stuff is just marvelous. Gonna mix it up like this to get the sugar to become part of the milk and the, and the nuts and berries. And then what we're gonna do is this. This is the ultimate in a dessert right here. Mmm. I love this. I can eat gallons of them. In fact, I think I will. For more information on pomegranates, come visit me on my website at thingsgreen.com. This is so good. Mmm. Oh, right, cameraman, you want some? This is no, you don't want any. Forget. This is, ew, remember? Yeah. Mm. Delicious stuff. Mm. program is brought to you in part by Grow Your Own. Start your organic container garden now. Choose a container for the plant you're going to grow. Be certain it has a drainage hole, then fill it up with miracle Grow Organic Choice Potting Mix, featuring all natural organic ingredients. Next, plant the seed or seedling, then water and feed with miracle Grow Organic Choice All-Purpose Plant Food. Use miracle Grow Organic Choice helping you grow bigger, more beautiful plants. Super Thrive, unique extra life, transplanting and maintenance. Impossibilities made easy. 1,860 to 75 year old trees dug up from grounds of 20th Century Fox Studios, stockpiled in weather for two years, replanted along city streets. The landscape architect and contractor reported not one sick or dead tree at any time. Only Super Thrive could have done this or even approached it. Super Thrive, ask for it by name at your local garden center or nursery. When you log on to thingsgreen.com, don't forget to visit Things Green TV. There, you're going to find moving pictures and interviews with celebrities and a whole lot of how to do things. That's on thingsgreen.com. Donate, volunteer, take classes, seeusonline.org.